The 15th of November 2023 is a day that has cast an atmosphere of fear, dread and apprehension on the residents of Osmanu village in Taraba state. On that horrifying day, persons suspected to be bandits, vandalized and forcefully released from police custody, a suspect arrested in possession of live ammunition and firearms, leading to the death of one Barasu Salisu. The gunmen were in Don. On the 11th of January 2024, this truck again, killing one person, and on the 2nd of June 2024, they attacked yet again and killed the village head of Usmanu community, forcing residents to call for security reinforcement to avert further breakdown of law and order. <laughs> Youths of the affected areas under the umbrella of Workun Youth Association of Nigeria used this press conference to appeal to concerned authorities to fish out the perpetrators, end extrajudicial killings, and ensure the return of peace to their community. We humbly call on His Excellency Dr. Abu Kepas to please consider the plight of our people, especially those in Usmanu village, and deploy adequate security reinforcement to safeguard lives and property. We also want to call on the Commissioner of Police to deploy skilled and well-trained personnel to restore sanity and uphold the dignity and integrity of the Nigerian police force in Usmanu village. Police authorities in Taraba State are investigating the series of attacks, assisted by professional hunters to comb the forest where the bandits are suspected to be hiding. As a matter of fact, I have given my DPOs the directive that all operations that they are carrying out, they should carry the hunters along. And they should equally monitor the activities of hunters in the various local governments so that they will not go and operate outside the confines of the laws of the land. So we are still very much um, um, uh, in collaboration. Aware of the situation, Governor Abu Kefes promises that his administration will strengthen community-based security initiatives to ensure ungoverned lands are not used to perpetrate evil. We continue to strengthen community-based security initiatives in collaboration with our security agencies to ensure that we sustain what we have started and to even improve better on that, extending it to the farmlands and the ungoverned spaces in Tower State. The Wokun Youth Association of Nigeria say they will continue to seek for justice until it is served to ensure they can return to their farms and ancestral homes without fear as the rainy season sets in.